Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google Account Lock security feature on an Android device, also known as the FRP Lock for Factory Reset Protection. Now, here with us today, we have a Samsung Galaxy Tab S4, and this is a cellular version that is actually for the network of U.S. Cellular here in the United States. And this is a device that does indeed have the Google Account Lock enabled, because as we can see here, as we're going through the setup steps, we get to the screen that tells us that the device was factory reset, and to continue, we have to either verify the previous security screen pin lock that was used, or if we tap on use my Google account instead, it'll pull up the secondary option that tells us that the other option or the other thing that we can do is to sign in with a Google account that was previously on the device. So we've been contacted by tons of customers over the years asking us for assistance with this specific issue on this specific model. And so we're now making a video to prove and show to anyone who's interested that we do indeed offer a service to be able to get the lock removed from this exact model without having to have the previous user's login info. It's something that we do directly to the device while it's plugged into a computer and the great thing about this is that it's something that can be done for just about anyone anywhere in the world so you don't necessarily need to be located here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you you would just need to have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast internet connection and we can remotely connect right to your computer through the internet to perform the exact same process that we did here with this one so actually before starting the video, we had already done 99% of the work necessary to remove the lock. We just left it in place as a visual proof so that you could all see that the device was indeed locked, that we can really do this, that we're not you know, secretly signing into our own account or any other trickery like that. The last step of the process is just to restart the device once. And then after that, we should be able to see that we can get all the way through the initial setup steps without running into that Google lock page. So just hold on here while it finishes rebooting. All right, so we are back at the initial setup screen here. So we're gonna go ahead and hit our blue start arrow to begin going through the process step by step. First, we have to read and agree to Samsung's terms and conditions. Then it'll give us a message about activating. We can just hit next. Then it'll ask us about Wi-Fi, which we actually don't need. We're just gonna turn it off and then hit skip. We don't need to copy any apps and data, so we're not going to do that. Then it'll show us all about the various Google services, so we'll just hit accept. We don't need a screen lock, so we're gonna skip that step also. We don't need a Samsung account either, so we'll say no to that. And there we go, it says we're all done. So when we hit finish there, we should be able to see. Yep, we've got the home screen loading up here. We've got full access to all of the apps and settings and features, and this is just like a brand new device that never had the lock on there. While we're here, we're gonna pop into the settings real quick just to verify and show you exactly what we are working with. So when we go under About Tablet, we can indeed see that we have a Galaxy Tab S4, and then that model number there, the SMT837R4, that is the model number of the US Cellular version of the Tab S4. And of course, it comes with cellular capability. So if you have one of these Tab S4s from US Cellular and need help getting the Google Lock removed from it, we would love to assist you with that. So go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will, can be found right down in the video description. And we'll also put a slide at the end of the video that has all of our details there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have on our channel as we offer a lot of different services for thousands of different models of devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy someday. 
Hitting that subscribe button while you're there will enable you to be notified of all of the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like we're doing here with this one. Y para todos ustedes hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes también nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks so much for watching, everyone, and have a great rest of your day.